Be bees on my neck, I shine in the dark. It's easy to slip, don't want you to fall. Why can't we? Yo, man, what is up, YouTube? I hope you guys are having a good day. Um, yeah, we got something a little bit different here today. We're gonna be going over the meta point guard builds in the game as of right now on next gen. Um, if you guys want me to, if you guys want me to start playing current gen, then we can lab over there a little bit. Definitely, definitely let me know. I know some of you guys are on current gen. Let me know, man, because we are in season three, and I've um, I've, I've been grinding just a little bit here, but. Before we start this video, man, if you are new, make sure you subscribe, turn notifications on. We are getting close to, I believe, I want to say, I want to say 8K, we're getting close to, so we're about 500 subs away. If you're new, man, definitely show some love. I really do appreciate everyone coming over to these videos and stuff like that. Turn notifications on, like this video, it does help me out a lot. Um, if you have any questions, hit me up in the comment section below. If you guys think I could have changed anything too in this video, um, yeah, let me know, let, let me know, we're going to go over three builds though. The three main builds in the game i don't want to say that we're gonna be really good we'll see what the legend rewards are um to be honest i don't know what they're gonna be are so we'll hopefully i'm hoping like it's been the past four or three years something like that uh we've been getting the 10 plus badge points i don't know if we're gonna get that many and i believe your badges some of your badges turned into um some of your badges turned into all the fame badges so like all your badges went up one your gold badges went up on stuff like that um so we're going over the first build that we're going over the six two that everyone makes bro um six nine wingspan and you can go slight weight too as well i don't i have one of these 88 three ball only if you know how to green you can kind of have to play a little bit closer to the line but i don't, I don't think chef works anyways like that works here and there it might work in wreck for you but um i'm just going over these builds man we'll see this is the build that does get contact dunks me personally um if you want to get small contact dunks you can i don't really see the, the purpose in it so i'm only going to put an 80 vert um that's, that's to get elite contact dunks if you want to get a small contact dunks that's an 85 so yeah there's that bullet pass or goal for some reason is better than the hall of fame this year you definitely have, um you definitely get lanes to more more with hall of fame which um is kind of confusing so I'll probably keep that at go i've been using gold and i've honestly i've not had a problem with it Went 96 people ball. You can go 93 if you want. Um, make sure you get gold unpluckable. Let's see. Let's see. I think I want, I think I'm an 89 ball. Yes, yeah, so I have 32 badges. Keep in mind to college. Um, if you've been playing every season two as well, you should have you should have 30, 30 or three three extra badges too. Plus the college on that if you make the rebirth. If you haven't made the rebirth yet, um, definitely definitely get those games in. And park. Um, that's definitely definitely worth it. Acceleration matters way more after this update, bro. For sure, you guys know how the update was. They nerfed speed and everything with ball and stuff like that. So, running low 90 speed. I went clamp silver, I want to say. So, a 76 perimeter. Uh, if they have it, like I said, the same as last year. If you hit legend, you'll have gold. So, that's not bad there. Hall of Fame interceptor is pretty, pretty insane with a 6'9 wingspan. I'm not going to lie. Um, it's just not bad at all. It's something I would make. You can get extra shooting badges. That's what I would put on the most. See if you can go down on close shot a little bit to get some extra shooting. You can't. Down bad, man. Down bad. But um, it's some out of magnetics. I don't feel like this is bad. You can go. You can get the extra two vert if you want. I would go put the rest on stamina. To be honest, just the way this game is, you definitely, definitely bleed in this game if you don't have Gatorade and stuff like that. So this is the first build. Um, six two gets contact dunks. Elite contact dunks can shoot. 28 shooting badges, 32 playmaking, 18 finishing, and 16 defense. So this is not a bad build if you've been playing every season. You'll hit legend, you'll see, you'll see how it's looking, man. We do get all the badges, you guys can see the points too. Keep in mind um, the points as well as how much it takes to upgrade. So five, each one, you just add those up. Add those up. Let me know what you guys think about that first one. I want to say that's just a build that can really just dunk, bro. Um, it's not bad. People still use the 510s. 510s is still, I'm, I want to say, not meta, but people still definitely use these. Um, if you want to, I would make a metric system PG. Um, just for the sake of this video, I'm not doing it because I don't feel like going over the exact points and stuff like that. Um, it's pretty easy to find metric system if you have any questions, like I said. Let me know, man, but going over the 510 um, to, to get Hall of Fame blinders. I don't think I'll be making any more 510s, though. Um, to be honest, I have so many, so many 510s, bro. It's insane. I think I, I think I literally made like five, five tens in the beginning of the year, which is um, yeah, pretty insane. So we want to get driver dunk at least, at least. That's what I've messed up a couple of my players. At least silver, limitless takeoff. Cause that definitely, definitely helps you dunk. I believe it's 74 dunk. Um, to get limitless takeoff silver. So yo, you should be able to dunk this here and there, man. We got a 90 steal, so we can get somewhat of steals. Interceptor Hall of Fame is the most OP badge on defense, for sure, man. Uh, we're gonna go with 85 pass accuracy once again. Uh, we don't need a Hall of Fame bullet pass for that. I'm telling you guys, I'm someone experienced using Hall of Fame bullet, bro. The badge, the badge is not, it's not like that. It's not, it's not like that. So 
We'll put our ball healing up. We can. I'm, I'm actually going to go back really quick since we're making a 510. You want to make a, um, I want to say, 5. Oh, we have to make a metric. So just for the sake of this video, bro, uh, you have to make a 510 metric and you will. Like I, I think it's like a 5, 9 and a half. Um, we'll go back actually. I'm just I'm just gonna show y'all really quick. So you Alright man, we are back. Just for the sake of this video, I went back to make the metric system so I can show you guys what um so you guys can get 99 ball handling to get Hall of Fame unpluckable. I don't know why I didn't wasn't gonna do that. I was about to set y'all up for sure. But um we're back, man. Hopefully I, that didn't take too long. We'll see. We'll see how long this takes. But metric 1.77. You guys can see it up top. Just copy it. Like I said, and go bullet passer. Better than Hall of Fame. Um, honestly, if we get the upgrades to get badges to Hall of Fame, I don't think I'm still gonna put it on Hall of Fame. I wouldn't go that high of a speed with ball. You don't know. Um, like I said, the, the way they nerf stuff in this game is definitely, it's definitely a little bit OD. But um, keep in mind too, the shorter you go, the higher for some reason the higher um, badge badge count you get to as well, which um, makes no sense. So it's 2K man. That's how 2K rocks sometimes. Like I said, driving down a 74. To get limitless takeoff then we got one more build after this this is currently the build i'm gonna be playing on not, not this 510 but the next build i'll show you guys which i pretty I, I me personally i think is the best in the game so we'll go something like this 90 speed um, not bad we'll get some extra shooting badges see if we can get 36 get that extra playmaking um how far can we can't get 98 speed with ball if you want to go more perimeter you can too as well so you can get somewhat of a contest at least bronze clamp i feel like it's not bad um so you can play some somewhat of defense keep in mind we got the plus fours too as well this is what i would make though um not bad man not bad we do get silver limits takeoff we can dunk a little bit 36 35 14 so you get a little bit more contest with the perimeter 64 not the, not the best this is still one of the metas though for a pure score bro for a 510 i'm not gonna lie that's, that's the build that i have right now um, that I was using a little bit earlier too so keep in mind of that um, next build I'm going to be showing you guys what I'm currently on um, is a 6.2 it's 6.1 for some reason when you make a metric though it says 6.2 um, 1.87 I believe my wingspan I want to say my wingspan is lower than that uh, it's a 1.96 so we do get 93 ball and we just only got gold limitless takeoff so if the legend rewards are the same we, we will get a hall of fame they will get Hall of Fame limitless takeoff. The only dunk package in this game too that really good for some reason is quick drops off one. Um, front clutches aren't bad. Sometimes they get blocked from behind, which makes no sense. Um, chase down artist is so OP. Um, I'm trying to think of something else. And then I believe I believe Michael Jordan dunk package is not that bad either. That doesn't really get blocked. So if we could get an 88 dunk on this build, that'd be amazing. But um, uh, honestly, it's fine. I'm not really tripping over it too much. I believe an 89 ball handling. 93 speed with ball and let's see what we can do on our pass accuracy here because we do get the plus fours when you go to do the facility um gatorade all that for your physicals so we'll see we'll see how this build is looking once we do once we do hit legend um hopefully it's still the same but we got a couple more days a couple more days until legend so we'll see we'll see what it is man honestly i honestly really do not know what, what 2k is gonna do well, honestly We'll see what's up with that. Um, I had to find some videos out for you guys. This is drag. This is dragging out just a little bit longer than I like. Um, so I'm sorry for that. If you're still here, man. If you're still here with me, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for staying for sure. But um, this is something I would make. I'm gonna go up on our perimeter so we get clamp silver once again. Um, we got some we got some good badges here. We can get intimidator too on this. But it's another good thing about this build. I went like a 60 block. I want to say. Um, I went like a 58 until I got chased down. Okay, so we got chased down on a 57. Put the rest on vert. We do get pro contact dunks at a 75, so that's not bad. We can dunk on guards and stuff like that. If you want to upgrade still a little more, you can really go either or from here. Um, it's really up to you. It doesn't really matter. I went I went for the extra shooting just to have 31, 32, and I put the rest on playmaking. Um, you can't take down cold shot or anything like that. So this is literally what exactly what I have. So. Let me know what you guys think about this build. Uh, let me know for sure if you guys think it's a good build, it's trash. That's all the three builds I got. Let me know if you guys are playing on a 510, 62, 61. Definitely, definitely hit me up. I'll probably do some more meta builds for um, power forward, shooting guard, and all that. Let me know if you guys want to see that. That's all I got, man. Enjoy the rest of your day.